Hi everyone, welcome to Acu Jobs YouTube channel. This is Lakshit from Acu Job Placement Team. Today I am in conversation with one of our alumni and student, Gaurav Kumar, who recently got placed at Gyanan in package of six LPA. Today he has come down to our office to visit us and celebrate his placement success and share his placement journey with all of you. So let's see and let's find out his placement journey at Acu Job. Hi Gaurav, how are you? I'm doing great, sir. Yeah, I'm doing well. So please uh, introduce yourself. So my name is Gaurav Kumar. I completed my graduation from Gautam Bodh University in 2021. Then I took a gap of one year for preparing for the defence exams. While I was in the preparation, I thought that why not keep a hand at the corporate life as well. So I decided to join a job, and I already had the interest in coding part. So I decided to pursue with the full stack course. Great, great, great. Good to know Gara about you. So, uh, I have a question. Of how did you get to know about Hack Your Job at first when you were already preparing for your, you know, defense exam? You had a gap year. So, how did you get to know about Hack Your Job? So, there was this one of my senior friend okay. who completed one of the course from Hack Your Job only, and he got placed. So, he suggested me like this is the course and you can do it, and like it is really very good course. So, I thought of it and did a little bit of googling. Okay, so how was your experience till now at Acu Job? Like, let's start from your batch manager. How how was the curriculum? How did you like the instructor and all the services which Acu Job students are getting? You know, who who are enrolling with us. So, how's your overall experience with us? Uh, if I talk about my overall experience, that was like um, very pleasant. I would say uh, my batch manager, who like Akshat sir, he was like really really very supportive during my whole process and in my like. Whole journey, he was right beside me, and uh, like the whole curriculum of like you get to study for one good month, and then you have to pass the module test as well as the interview. Only then you'll be able to get to the very next module. So the whole concept was like very good until and unless like you don't pass that that module, you'll not be able to pursue. Right. So like you have to constant keep your like constantly you have to put hard work in that. So I would say like the whole journey was like very smooth for me. It was like I was preparing for it. I was like giving my hundred percent, and like, that like, actually paid me off. Nice, nice, amazing, Gaurav. So uh, give us a light about our mentors and instructors at IQ Job. What did you like most about them? How did they help you? How available they were for you, and how they actually helped you to crack this coding job? If I talk about the availability of the uh, instructors, like. I would say 24/7 because like the moment I was having any doubt, I just went to the online doubt session, and at that very moment it was like getting cleared at that point only. Okay. So and the instructors were like totally like they used to give you like very very much real life examples, okay. in which I was able to get the whole concepts very thoroughly. Right. And like if I to tell you one incident as well, like okay. in, in the company in which I got placed, mm-hmm. so I was in my second round of the interview. And he asked me about the OOPS concept. Hmm. So the way I was explaining the OOPS concept and the whole example thing, and the way I like hmm. kept it right in front of him. So he like actually complimented me, saying that do you like blogs or something? Okay. I said no, and then I asked why he was saying that. Like when he told that the way of explanation was so good. Nice. So nice. the whole credit I would say is go to the instructor some day. Amazing, amazing. That they have really put out so much hard work. in you and mm-hmm. you were able to take it up as well so right so okay you told me that your experience was very good while giving the interview so i believe that i can hope was able to help you in soft skill building as well right and on in inculcating those soft skill you know habits and how to introduce etc etc so like how was the preparation you know for you at acu job throughout the interviews i mean how did it actually help you okay So although I was already preparing for the since like I told you like for the defense exam and that is more of a personality development test mm-hmm. so they just test your personality there okay. so I was like prior to the course I was already working on my personality and all doing all of that and but I was not having that corporate touch I would say mm-hmm. that I was like my whole thinking was like in the uh, government sector only. Okay. Yes, and for corporate you need little more, like little bit very different things. Mm-hmm. So I was for like 
I got to know that in active job only, and the moment I got to know, like I implemented them, and then I was able to make it. Amazing to know. And please tell us more about your uh, placement journey. I mean, how was the placement assistance at, at Acura Job? How how much rejections did you face before actually getting placed, right? And what were the qualities which you really liked about Acura Job that helped you getting placed in placement department, basically? Okay, okay. So I got placed when I was in my seventh month of the course. Okay. Yes, and this was the very first company in which I was like not even able to. Get, like I was not even eligible for that particular for this particular company. Okay. Uh, but like since I like had the like urge that why not like mm. I should sit in the placement. So I asked my batch manager that could you please uh, mm. send like yeah make me mm. eligible for it. So he did and he said that it is for the front end role okay. and your whole course which you are pursuing right now is for back end role. Right. So I don't think that you will be able to make it through. Okay. So still I like. I insisted that please make it. Okay. So after like like the whole process of the placement went for around one and a half months. Okay. And right from the very first assessment where I like cleared my screening test mm-hmm. and then a programming test given by the companies and only. Mm-hmm. Then I had two interviews, and after that two interviews I had uh, one interview with the CEO of the company. Okay. And like clearing all the rounds, I, then I make it through. And yeah, that is. Okay, great, great. Okay, so uh, how was your family reaction, by the way? You know, coming from uh, from a government job preparation for a year and then landing to a dream job in just six months of time. So, how was your parents' reaction? How did you feel after you get placed in such a short time after coming to that job? Uh, so, if I talk about my parents' reaction, so they totally wanted me to go like to pursue the corporate. Okay. Yeah, but it was right. Like I had this childhood dream that I want to go to that side only. That I want to go to the defense. Okay. So like he was constant, constantly saying, like my father was constantly saying that uh, there's no point of like preparing for the government exams. Why don't you like pursue this side and mm-hmm. like everything is good in this as well. Okay. Yes. So I said him that just give me my chance. Uh, okay. Like until my age allows, I'll just try it and like, check my luck. And if not, I'll definitely join corporate life as well. And I'll definitely get in touch with the uh, corporate side. Like I'll just keep refreshing my knowledge so that I don't lose any touch from that side. Right. So yes, and I was like, when I was preparing for the defense, as well as I was like also pursuing the course of IT job. So like both of the things were hand in hand, and like I got placed earlier. So like, right now my family is like very happy and. Like this is the very first time right from my childhood that my uh, like my father helped me. Oh this wow! Never, yeah, this wow. never happened as I can relate to this feeling. Yeah, so this was like a very special moment for me. Yeah, that's great. That's great that we are able to create such impacts on a student like you. Amazing. So, by the way, what advice now you would like to give to the learners and coders who are at Acura Job and joining Acura Job every month? What do you feel? What you should want to tell them? To get placed. So the only advice which I think which I should give to them will be that you will get placed. But if you want to get placed early, make sure that you stay in the top people. Okay. If you don't do that, then you can like you have to wait for the placement. You will definitely get placed. But if you want placement very quick, then you have to be in the like top ten or to like top twenty people. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So this advice I would give. And apart from this, like. Keep working, keep working hard. Okay, so, yeah, how they can actually do it? How they can be in a top list of students? According to you, how did you do it at your time? So, it the only thing is practice. Like, right. There's no like no escape from the hard work. So, like you have to put in your efforts. You have to put at least ten to like around ten hours mm-hmm. straight. Ten hours you have to give to coding. If you are not from a non-tech background. Okay. If like. In my case, I was from the tech background only, mm-hmm. so I had that uh, thinking and I had that knowledge building earlier as well. Right. But if you like switch and your line or your job profile, then mm-hmm. in that case you have because like coding, I won't say like it is very difficult, but I won't even say that it is like very easy as well. Right. You have to like um, you have to touch very different wire of your brain right. like in order to like get that logic. Yeah. Yeah. So that you have to do and like. Just put an effort and you'll make it through for sure. Okay. 
today good to know more of uh, so nice advice for our students right and tell us something about uh, your job as well have you already joined gyandan and what tech stack you are working on how do you feel going to office every day how's your corporate life finally going on so if i talk about my company so i took like my i joined on 16th of march okay and it's been one week since i joined and i would say the uh, the whole system is like up and down because like from past one year i was at my home only like chilling and not going anywhere so and now i have to travel one and a half hours like from my place to office and then I have to spend the whole day and then all that although like my like office place is like very good and the environment the environment is like very great okay and the people around me are like very helpful Mm-hmm. Uh, the tech team is like right now very small, mm-hmm. but the people in the tech team are like uh, the people who took my two interviews, two mm-hmm. technical interviews. Now they are my uh, like one of them is the manager and one of them is my colleague. Okay. Yeah. So if I talk about the environment, like it is very friendly and like the more free mind you are, the more productive you can be. And yeah, that's how the office is. Okay. And I'm actually enjoying the office right now. Amazing, amazing. Tell us about the tech stack also you are working at. Then. Yes. So the tech stack from the past one week, which they have asked me to learn, is Ruby on Rails. Nice. Yes. So that is something which I was like not having a single clue about that um, right. that tech stack. Mm-hmm. Uh, there I was having a like at the moment of hiring, mm-hmm. I was asked for JavaScript and React. Okay. That I had little bit of knowledge. Mm-hmm. Uh, but the moment I entered, they asked me that do you know Ruby or not, and my straight answer was no. Mm-hmm. But they said that. you just learn ruby mm-hmm. if you know who the java mm-hmm. then like you can definitely uh, cope up with ruby as well so that's what i'm doing and from the past one week i'm just learning ruby and from the monday this upcoming monday like i'll be full fledged with the uh, amazing amazing got it got it yeah got it great great i think that's it from my side bro thank you so much for coming to agile job office we wish you all the best thank you right for your future right keep coming keep referring right we are always there for you thank you so much for coming thank you guys for watching us and for more such videos please do like share and subscribe to our channel to see more interesting and inspiring stories at the job see you soon